fuck is up, pop culture, Simon? I feel like opening some shit. <clears throat> so we're gonna open this since I tried to give it away twice unsuccessfully. This here is the sideshow. I think it's the sideshow exclusive version. Han Solo Bespin from like 2000 something. Two thousand six. He's old school, man. This is old school sideshow. Here's the box. Who else was in there? They had a Mace Windu, a Qui Gon, and a Darth Maul. I wouldn't mind having that Mace Windu. Heroes of the Rebellion. It's got that old school gatefold. And my knock right there is what made it an exclusive, I believe. Actually, I know. It's got a bunch of bullshit written on here. I wonder if that oxygen mask is exclusive too. What was all this crap written in here? Nah, blah blah blah. Uh, just it tells you about the damn. Uh... Let's see which side should I start with first. Damn, is there even anybody on here? Is this thing on? Hey, there's one person on here. So, Got a Gennaro old school stand. Yay, you're here. Number one fan and president of the fan club. I don't know. Uh oh, what was that? Here's the uh, his holster. Actually, not bad detail. I mean, this sideshow, even though it's old school, early sideshow. It's got a clip here for something. Probably old school magnets. I don't know. Right out of the box, it's ripped. That ain't a good sign. Sucker was brand new. Well, I guess brand new in 2006. This here. 2006 is what year it came out. I don't know what that is, dude. I don't think there's even instructions in here. I'll have to look. Oh, look at this blaster. You think you've heard of Sideshow, huh? <laughs> Yeah, it is a pretty nerdy company. They have some really cool nerdy stuff. Not a bad job on the blaster. And last but not least in this side. His respirator. Audi Diana. It's actually pretty cool. Got the little band. Thank you. Alright. That's side number one. Go ahead and slide that back in there. Alright, we can put the 
stand together. It's got the old school waist grabber. Side number two. Maybe. I might fuck this box up, but it'll be alright. Get out. Dang, that sucker was in there tight. Here's the meat and the potatoes. Oh wow, this Minoc is awesome. Uh, I don't think she bought it for me, but I'm pretty sure she was there when I got it. Look at how awesome the Minoc is. I'm killing the box probably, but it'll be alright. He has a magnet in his mouth, so I'm curious. I am freeing him right now, Jasmine. There is no tape. It was, it's just the uh, old school fold-ins. No tape. It'll be okay. And here he is. Free from the carbonite. Oh wow, it's so weird feeling a figure with the old school articulation after you've been used to the new ones. But actually, man, he's as tight too, man. It sounds like, I don't know if you guys can hear it. Huh. Man, it sounds like you're breaking his bones when you move him. <laughs> click, 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 like ratchet. The outfit is not bad. His belt is undone. I don't know what's been going on in this package, but... And my big fingers probably will never be able... Huh? Maybe. Maybe. I spoke too soon. Big fingers prevail. The detail's pretty good. Oh, I wonder. I don't know why there's a magnet in there. <laughs> right? Crack, 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 crack. You hear this? So loud. Let's give him his uh, gum belt. Uh oh. I think I figured this thing might go here. Yeah. I do have the. Han premium format. I can grab him. Hold on. Uh. Uh. That guy. He's pretty sweet, isn't he? You guys can look at him while I try to get this daggum belt on him. Ooh. I'm scared I'm gonna break it. Stretch. Maybe. 
Dang, it's awful tight. That's what she said, right? <laughs> Yeah, it is kind of cozy only because it's a bunch of toys. <clears throat> I'm gonna push that back and maybe I can. Yeah, he's pretty rad. He also has a stormtrooper blaster. And. I think that's the only interchangeable thing he has. Well, I successfully got his gun belt on here, but I'm having problems shifting it around. There we go. Because in my opinion, it should be down here around his waist, but it won't fit. There we go. Got to get it over the belt humps. I will send you the statue so you do not have to cry, Autumn. Alright, that's about as good as that's going to get for now. Because I'm having a problem. The statue is in the way now. So I have to... not satisfied with the way it sits. The mic may have to break it. Ah! So close. Get in there. Annoying. So we're gonna go this route. So that's one thing. About the old sideshow figures, man, the accessories are a pain in the ass to get on. See, it's got one of those just little... One little hole over here. And this little clasp to get in there. But there's no room, especially for big finger bastards like me, to click it in. I guess I could show you the, uh... And the latch, the clasp, man, that's scary, too. You know what? I'm not even going to bother trying. But we will put the oxygen mask on him. Tweezers, that's a good idea. Thank you, Jasmine, for that brilliant idea. I will shoot an updated picture with it actually on him. I'm just trying to figure out... Let's get him in this. Because I'm pretty certain he will not stand without the stand. Yeah, I should keep some on deck, huh? Some tweezers. On deck all the time. I want to know where this Minox sticks. <laughs> he does have sleep apnea. Maybe, uh... Oh, wow, that's a little weird, though. Hold on. You can magnetize it to his butt <laughs> on the back of the stand. Alright, I'll give it one more try. I ain't got shit else to do. So let's try. 
Ooh, you know what I do have? Hemostats. Let's see. Maybe pull these pants up. He does have an hourglass figure. No? Is that a no to the having the Minox sucking his butt? Alright. Wish me luck. I'm going in. Get on there. This is hard. I'm not sure that these hemostats are helping. Get on there. I might end up having to super glue the daggum thing. <laughs> okay. Alright, I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Oh, get in there. I'm going in. I don't know how this goes together. I believe that's going to need some repair. But I got it on him for the most part. He's definitely not the prettiest figure. But he's not bad. I mean, I can tell who he is for sure. And for being a, what is this, a 14 year old figure, all the articulation and everything still holds steady. He can do ninja kicks and shit. I don't know about the Minoc with the magnet. It's a little weird. Seems how the only place I can find for it to stick. Uh oh, this may be a problem. There we go. I mean, he's Han. Happy New Year, there, Scotty. Maybe we can. Here, let's try this. See if I can. Do this pose. Alright. Let's see here. It's the pose challenge. Okay. I think I nailed it. I nailed it, son. Huh? Huh?
There he is. 2006 Sideshow exclusive Han Solo. Kind of glad I didn't end up giving them away now that you open it and there's uh, shit wrong with them. I don't know. I may still end up giving them away to somebody who doesn't care that there's a couple issues that need fixed. It is a pretty good post. It's like a, a me and mini me situation, isn't it? I'm just going to leave him in this post with a Minox stuck in his butt. I don't get it. What's going on, Sideshow? I need explanations for this butt sucker. Guess I can have him holding his mask. You volunteers tribute. <laughs> I don't know. What do y'all think of that bad boy? He's definitely not, uh... Maybe you should screenshot this and send it to Sideshow and be like, What's up with the butt sucking Minoc? Nah, the base is all plastic. That's literally the only thing it'll stick to is the uh, back of the base. Strange. I mean, maybe they like thought people would put it on their refrigerator or something. It's cool. For sure. But it's literally just a butt sucker. Yeah, maybe I'll put it on my fridge. I definitely gotta work on some positioning of this thing. Maybe not, maybe I'll just leave it. Because they're just old janky figures, man, you know? The Faith figure is so janky, dude. The Gentleman figure is even older than the Faith figure. But, uh, he's still really cool. I have a video of him if y'all want to check it out on YouTube. Or maybe I'll start doing a classic review like this every now and then, if y'all want. But that's him, man. He has this here, sleep apnea mask. Because, you know, Han Solo's got the apnea. He's an old timer, son. The outfit is still decent, I think. There he is. So what do y'all think? It is cool to see the classics. Maybe like, I don't have, I only have like Really, two or three more. I got Faith and the Gentleman. And the Cobra Commander, but he's more... He's, he's better, but still classic. So we could do Cobra Commander, too. There he is. And all of his butt-sucking glory. You're welcome for showing him off. I 
Oh, you want the, you want this too? You want both Hans? You want the butt sucking Han? Ooh, he slid down, man. He's getting full. <laughs> He's funny, man. The butt sucking Minoc. <laughs> His face does have a guilty expression. Let's pull off his apnea mask. Look at him. He knows that he's got the thing attached to his butt. Alright, there he is. Thanks for watching. I guess, uh, I will tag the, uh, <laughs> he is getting full. The people that wanted to see more classic reviews, when I, and I'll do Faith. I'll put up a poll, Faith, Gentleman, and Cobra Commander, and let y'all pick who's next on the classic review. And I'll do it here in the group, I won't do a YouTube video. You're welcome. Thanks for watching. And until next time. Ooh, I want to see what kind. Of, make her redo the face and take a picture and put it in the comments. Because I bet it's a pretty funny face. Until next time. From the asylum and the butt sucker. Show me some motherfucking toys.